Hello everyone, how are you? Did you visit the Guess what they did to us this morning? I left my phone at home. Why would I do that? So I thought I would vlog a little before, like, you know, but even though so my mum's going to pray, so. Yeah. I thought I'd do a quick vlog before, like, I end the vlog, but don't worry, it's till midnight to go. So, yeah. Two more, let's see what happens, but uh, let's see what happens. Mm. Anyway, um, how are you guys? Anything happening in your yard? Because hopefully you have a better day than me, because... I had two numbers, right? I blocked them because obviously they didn't leave any message or voice mail or anything. I blocked them because obviously strangers dangerous. If they don't leave a message, then they don't doubt my they don't get to deserve to know me. <laughs> Sorry guys, but I don't like having strangers having my number. So I have to block them straight. So I know. But even so, I'm watching um, Shadow and Bones, Shadows and Bones for episode 4 now, so yeah. Oh, oh my days. <laughs> He's that. Anyway, um, but what's been happening in your yard? Hopefully better than mine. Been working for five hours. Tomorrow again, five hours. The, tomorrow, I'll try to remember to take my phone. Really, I locked the door. I'm checking my pockets. I'm like, there's something missing in my pocket. What is this? Always three things on my right pocket. And then I remembered my phone. I was knocking, screaming, all the stuff I could do, but none of them came. So I had no choice but to leave my phone at home. And it was still safe. But yeah. <sighs> I am trying my best. You know, stone, oh, sorry, shadows and bones. Is a very dangerous show. And I've not read any books. Oh, no, 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 no. How did he find them? Just like that. Oh. This is so unfair. It's because of her, Alina. Oh, wait. That's the um, Is that the mom? Is that his mom? Well, it took a long time to get there. Oh. Really? Oh, gosh. She's not going to show her face. Oh. Poor girl. I just can't believe the mother had found them as dead. Anyway, I'll talk to you in a bit because I think there's something interesting going to happen with the mom. Let's see what the darkly mom has to say. Mm. Alright guys, this is me in my vlog. It is bedtime and it's nearly half two. I'm nearly finished with shadows and bones. Oh, it's half two. It's seven past two. Mm. Not bad actually. Came to bed a little bit earlier than before, which is good. It was something I was gonna say, but I left my phone at home. That's a huge thing because me leaving phone at home is like, really? Why would I do that? Because there was no charge, and uh, whatever I do, I check everything before I leave the house. Everything in my pockets and everything. I don't know why I ignored my phone. My phone has been ignored all day. Well, not all day, but you know what I mean, since I got home, so, but still. My phone's been home. I told no. I forgot to take my phone with me. And she's like, how can you take your phone? I was like, 
Well, I don't know. I just forgot about it. It's something that I'm usually not in a... I don't know, I'm stressing, okay, guys? I don't know why. It's been happening since I watched that show. Shadows and Bones. I think anybody have a hint why? Yeah, something to do with Darkling. Mm. But, anyway. I think... I don't know how he is affecting my life. But it happened. It is him. Only him. But then I'm stressing life normally as well. I need money. Anybody needs money, okay? I just want a little bit more money. But I, but since I watched, as I said, Shadow and Bones, my memory is nothing straight at all. So, tomorrow's going to be the last day of watching it. So it should be no more distraction by the darkling doesn't matter if he's got scar disease i still think he's hot very hot anyway you know one thing right everybody see the villain is the worst person in the world but tell you the truth once they fall in love with a person and they will destroy the world just to have them Makes it very romantic, but that's a huge red flag. But, oh, I don't know why I have something for bad guys. It's just that making him look so bad doesn't make it look bad. Because the love he has for Alina is kind of like... Alexander, why are you doing this? Why can't you not be a little bit more normal than being an obsessed narcissist of a guy? Is he a narcissist? Oh, I think he's more of a narcissist than anyone I could believe. He's very he manipulates a lot and he will get what he wants if he didn't lie. There's a way of knowing, but still, why is he so, like, you can't hate him if you want to hate him. He's that kind of character. It's like going from Loki, you know Loki, right? The Thor's brother. So yeah, Loki saying, if... Loki had love, proper love, then he wouldn't be the bad guy at all. Because you could see there's so much loving inside him. There's so much love, but he still wants to destroy the world for the person he loves. But I've never seen him love anyone except until he found another version of himself called... Was it Sylvia? Sylvia? I forgot. Anyway, Darkling. Even so, he loved her so much. She betrayed him so many ways. Like, literally, to reject him so many ways. And he still wants her. She even tried to kill him. Well, she didn't, but her boyfriend did. Mel did. Even he's kind of cute. I don't know. I think he's cute. I wouldn't call him hot. I call him cute. But I think the king is cute and hot. The one Elena was about to marry. I forgot what his name was. You know, I realized I didn't concentrate his name. Ah, huh. and I find him hot. Pretty weird. Never mind, I know he's a king, so his father died, his brother died, so he's the next king. He's gonna marry Elena, but you know what I mean? Oh my god, so much chaos. Darkling, why did you have to do this? <sighs> Even your mother killed herself just to make you better. <sighs> so annoying. She did everything to take his hands off. 
she's I do feel bad for the mother. She had to destroy it. And I feel bad for Mel Moore. From all the things he could have be he had to be the birdline of the other sister. It's so common, like cousins fighting cousins, but come on. Oh, I just feel bad for him. Ugh, why didn't he not make the story that Mel was nothing? But then he, how could he hear all those, you know, things? How, I think that's why he was a tracker, isn't he? Because he tracks. <sighs> he tracked Alida. He tracked the stag. He tracked the singing, whatever that is. I don't know, a dragon or whatever. And now he couldn't hear himself, which is so bad. Why did he have to die? Well, actually, I don't know if he does die or what. But the love between them is so pure. I think he will still be alive, won't he? But I'm sure Darkwing's gonna die. <laughs> Poor bad. Poor boy. He never got love that he deserved. No, even from his mother. Come on, man. His mother tortured him quite well. <sighs> he did everything, but yet she sacrificed herself. To make him better, but he never did. He'd rather be what he had to be. The villain. You know, it's a good thing, real life, I'm just saying, that we don't have much villains, much narcissist like him who manipulates your mind and your thoughts to believe that what they're saying is right and trying to hurt your feelings away to see that nobody else will love you but me etc etc I don't know because I don't meet much narcissist. You know, so my mom's one of them, but still, I don't call her narcissist because she's a mother. So I believe her she's a mother, but she, you know, narcissist is narcissist. <sighs> Since I was a kid, man, <sighs> mothers. <sighs> At least I know how Darkling feels, how the mother treats them. Not that bad, though. Not that bad. My mom, my mom has depression and anxiety, so think about it. It is much worse than what Darkling has to go through. But I love my mother. I always love her. Doesn't matter how much she hates me, hits me, shouts at me, tries to kill me. Not kill me, but you know what I mean. Tries to destroy me. Oh, doesn't matter. I still love her. She's my mother. She deserves my love. Unconditional love. I wish Darkling had that. A little at least. He deserves an unconditional love. A little. You know what I mean? Poor guy's gonna die without love. His own mother had to kill herself just to make him understand. But yet he doesn't. His stubbornness isn't taking him to the next level. I just saw bad. Anyway, I'm just going to end the vlog here, guys, because <laughs> I've been talking more than 10 minutes. That's what happens when you leave your phone at home and you're like, you have nothing to do but you, to say, but you just say a lot. Even if you're talking about a show. Anyway, I'm just going to end the vlog now because that is over like my limit of talking i don't think i could do more than this so i'm just gonna end it now so i hope i take care like and subscribe hopefully tomorrow does have better days and hopefully darkling is not gonna take my life anymore alexander please leave i just need my peace good night yeah i know i'm a bit weird but what can you do 
everybody has that fiction character that does take over your lives one or another anyway good i guess hmm.